Hi, my name's Tom Witter. I'm from Moorfield Presbyterian Church, and I've been coming to day camp for four years now. Reverend Catherine introduced me to day camp, and I can truthfully say that day camp has saved me, and I've fallen in love with it, and I'm one of the camp advisors now. So uh, I organize getting the tents put up every week before camp and cleaning up and help Amy and Lori organize the classes. We have a ministry team and we meet uh, starting in January to start planning for camp in June. So camp is just great and it has saved me. I really love this camp and the teens and the kids. So that's about it. <laughs> it's just a lot of these kids. That's all they have for the summer. They can't afford vacations. Their you know their parents send them here to have the blast of their life, you know. But, and I just I really uh really hope God keeps this place going as long as He can. You know, God's really my my place here is really uh been strengthened with God for uh, for all the leadership. Uh, Pastor Doug who comes here. You know, I love him. He he's a really great influence in my life as a as a camper. And he he's come back after a two three year absence, and he's really done great with the kids. I'm Nancy Hornback. I bring 15 kids from Wardensville, West Virginia. Has to do with the Methodist Church in Wardensville. And I, I drive the van. And I've been coming for four years because of Ann Webster, who I had as a student in school. And um, it's great. I, the kids, as soon as I get home from Florida in April, they want to know how soon we can go to Camp Patty Run. I don't even hardly get back from Florida in the wintertime. And it's exciting, and the kids get to learn about the Lord, and it's secure, and it's safe, and it's a blessing, and they all, I hope more and more can come. Next year, maybe more. Well, uh, so for my stay here has been awesome. Um, the, the lodge is great. It's fully stocked with food and, um, you know, amenities that are necessary for living in the woods and keeping everyone clean. Uh, as far as the camp goes, it's, it's very good for the kids. All the kids seem to love it. Um, it's safe. Uh, the accountability as far as counselor to student and, and child connection is, is, is uh, it's, it's safe. Accountability is great. Uh, back where I'm from, we stress safety and from what I can tell, it's very safe here. Uh, uh, my walk with the Lord, is, uh, it's been a long one. It's been, it's, uh, been a great journey. Um, I didn't always have a father growing up. It's always been my mom and my siblings. And uh, I've always been the man of the house. I've had to raise myself in that way. And through my church, all of the male influences in my life have raised me to be who I've become. And I couldn't be more appreciative of that. And that's why I want to do stuff like this and come out here and volunteer at Camp Patty Run because these kids, they need influences like that, male and female, but even more so, like all the guys out here that we've brought um, from Texas, I mean, we've been trying to minister to these kids and they love it. They've been soaking it in. We can tell on, or on their faces that they they need these influences and it's been so great it's been so smooth we've been getting to know the kids you know there's there's been some bonding there and it's been great uh, okay go I'm Jordan Gano I'm 14 I'm from Kansas and I've come out here with my aunt for the last six years and it means a lot for me to be out here because it's one really great opportunity to get really close with God um, it's brought my faith up quite a bit, honestly, because I used to not go to church that much, that often, and now I do come a lot. Okay, how I feel about the program uh, here at Camp Patty Run is very, very good. Um, I've been actually with a lot of different churches and seen a lot of different um, kids, ministries kind of thing, and this is a very, very good one. Um, I actually saw one girl who, when I first started talking to her, she was very, um, very closed off. You know, she'd kind of grumble at me when I would talk. And um, when I'd ask her questions, she wouldn't really open up. And after just one day of being here and surrounded by the whole environment of Camp Patty Run, she was running around smiling, laughing, and just probably the most energetic girl you've ever seen. And I've seen that happen with at least four or five other people here. And um, we've all become very close. I've only been here for four days, and I'm already, you know, thick as these the other counselors. So it's a very good setup they've got going on here at Camp Patty Run. Three. Hi, my name's Lori Orndorff. I have been a volunteer here at Camp Patty Run for 12 years. I could say this place means more to me than anything because I was a counselor here in 1995, 96, and 97. And when I came in 1995, I met this girl who's been my best friend for 21 years. I met my husband 
and we have our daughter because of Camp Patty Run. But more than that, this camp has put me on my faith journey and my closeness to God and has led me to put Jesus as my Lord and Savior. And I just want to be here to pass it on to our younger generation so that they can grow and be a Christ's kid. Lori and I met in the summer of 95, and we have been so bonded because of our experiences here at Camp Patty Run. It's funny that in our culture today, everyone is searching for the fountain of youth. The fountain of youth is working with youth. If you want to stay young and laugh and feel 21 again, coming to Patty Run every year and working with such a great group of kids is the best way I can think of to feel perpetually 21 years old. Um, this camp has blessed me so much. I have learned more in my faith walk from the kids because of their questions, because of the things that they bring to the table. I've learned what challenges are all about, and those questions has brought me to seek him even more. I want to be a better person for them. I want to be a better counselor and a better steward for God's work, and I just thank God that he has given us a place like Patty Run to do his service. Light on 